Okay, so the next one for us to demo here is copy as RTF. And there's a key binding for this as well as a right click that I find sometimes I have to use. And it tells you the default and it tells you the default uh, styles here that are going to be applied, but there are some different options as well. And we'll notice as well, this is pretty common in Atom. This was taken from a Sublime package, Sublime Highlight. So the attribute there. Okay, so I've got copy as RTF set up. And like I said, there are some key bindings for this. I have not really been able to get them to work and haven't played around with switching them to something else. Uh, so what I usually do is, let's say we're working in our code and I want to copy this block of code over. I just right click and then select copy as RTF. And then let's say we wanted to come into PowerPoint, for example, and I had a slide here that I wanted to put some code on. Now when I paste this, notice, wow, it is nicely formatted. It looks all good by default. and uh, I could simply edit any of this and I don't have to worry about um, the code correction or the colors and everything. They're already set and going there. Now let's say that we had a different color slide deck and this color scheme didn't work. One thing we could do inside of the package settings are choose different styled themes. So this is important. When you copy and paste using this, it's not going to copy and paste using the theme that you're using. It's going to use the theme that you set here. And there's a link to all of the different theme options. So if we open that link up, we could see here are examples of each of the different types of themes that we could choose from as well as a little demo. And so if I wanted to have the Vim, I'd simply type in Vim here and you don't have to save or anything. It'll automatically work. Um, I leave it to this one. The Monokai is pretty good for dark presentations. However, if you are working with a light background, then you don't want to use uh, this because there's a lot of white text in some of the dark background ones. So play around with what works best for you. And if you do do a lot of code presentations or things, this is essential and saves so much time um, for being able to copy things out really nice.